Thank you for joining Hawaii Wellness Network. And today we have Dr. Barry Nutter, which I have known for a very long time. That's right. Thank you for coming. We're very honored. Oh, well, thanks for inviting me. Yeah, there's so many people that I know that actually have, have um, been to your office and benefited and I have heard many, many stories over the years. So would you like to tell a little bit about your practice? I mean, you just have so many credentials and you work with so many different modalities, but first you're a chiropractor, and then what other degrees and modalities do you have? Okay, there's, you know, there's one thing I wanted to mention. Okay. You know, back when I started rolfing, this was 40 years ago. Uh, like I said, Rolf, I have returned to you know do more rolfing than anything else because that's the one thing I found that really makes a difference in people's lives. And this last year, I had two of my sons that went to rolfing school, and so they're now doing rolfing. And in the process, uh, we picked up another rolfing practitioner. So I have, uh, there's four of us in my office that do rolfing. So uh, in the advanced rolfing series, they teach what's called forehand rolfing, so two rolfers work on one person. Wow. And so sometimes, three rolfers can work on one person, so they'd call that six-hand rolfing. And the difference is phenomenal, because when you are pushing on someone's tissue one direction, they naturally go away from your push. But if someone's pushing in one direction and someone's pushing in the other, then the only way they can go is up. And that's the whole goal of rolfing, is to create length in the body, so to help the person find their line, and then to use that line in their daily life. Most people think about rolfing, they think, oh, I, I know that can fix your back or your neck or your shoulder. Right. They don't think about our real purpose is to enjoy life by finding your line and living in your line. And our founder, Dr. Rolf, always claimed that the highest form of yoga one could practice would be to just find your line and stand in it. That's all you need to do. Balance. And just be there, just be balanced. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. So we do four-hand rolfing, and once in a while we do six-hand rolfing. That would be really that's, interesting. That's that, really that, I've had rolfing done. That would be very intense. Yeah. Get all your internal organs and everything aligned. Yeah. And, yeah, and actually, you know, you'd think it's very intense, but it's very comforting to have more hands on you right. to connect. Because what we're doing is connecting with the same layer of tissue. Uh, I might be on the knee, and someone else might be on the ankle, and someone else is on the hip. But we find that layer, and as soon as we connect with the layer, we can feel each other and feel the energy there. If we go too deep or too shallow or we're off of the layer, you can tell. And then we have the person move, so that's the, that's the best part because they move and they feel so different than it's just one person that's working with them. But, it's I mean, almost like getting a one-hour massage is really good, but then when you get that the 90 minutes of the two-hour massage, it's like, how did I ever not get that? Not get that Yeah, before. it's like so much better. Right. Yeah. That's great. Yeah. Well, th thank you for joining us. And okay, thanks. I can't wait to hear all the great stories in 2014. Okay, well, I'll collect some stories for you. Great, thanks. <laughs> thank you.